everyone, I hope you're all doing well. Uh, today I am finally putting photo cards in my binder. These are all cards I got from purchases, trades or album purchases. And I've just been keeping them in a box for the past 4-5 months maybe. And um, yeah, they really need to be stored safely. So yeah, I'm gonna do that today. So, let's just get to it. <laughs> Okay, so I think a little bit of it is out of frame, but we're gonna start with my saddest binder, let's be honest. This is my girl group binder, and uh, yeah, I haven't been really working on any collection in this lately, uh, so it's, it just looks very empty, like, it's, it's ready for the photo cards, but I still need them. Uh, yeah, so we have all these little babies to store so there's oh, three uh, red velvet cards and then only idols so for red velvet I've been trying to collect full groups for all albums um, and everything is ready <laughs> I just need the cards now which is the most complicated things and Oops, yeah, I've been using these little, they're not sticky notes, just, they're just little piece of paper and I I really like them because they're the perfect size for this. I got them on AliExpress, so <laughs> that was a great deal. And for all my girl group cards that fit in them, obviously, I use these Dragon Shield um, sleeves. They're the, one, the ones that come in the 60 sleeves packet thing and I I think the size is somewhere that's these are these ones um, I'll try to remember the, the link in the description if ever you're interested but yeah I really like these ones they're not too thin and they're very clear so that works well for, for me I never know which side to put them on That's the other way, like I always get this wrong and then I don't like that they're not all facing the same way. Okay. Oops. Okay. Then I have this too. These are the scratch cards from the La Rouge show. And yeah, that's the one. It came in a set with uh, one photo card. So I have Yeri for that. And I don't know why I did not store these at the same time. So we're going to do this now. So that's Joyce card and Yuri's card. There we go. And then these are to prepare for um, Irene and Sogi's subunit thing. And I still haven't prepared the the little sticky note things for the two other versions. I always mix them up. This is the base note. And then there were the two that are in boxes, kind of. So, yeah. So, moving on to Idol. Uh, so, I have these two tickets from Dumpty Dumpty. And these cards from I Trust. I always mix up the names of the albums. This is really nice. Uh, so I don't really know. They fit in nine pocket sleeves, but I they won't fit in the Dragon Shield sleeves. And I think they're bigger than the Monster X cards. I'm gonna try something out. Would they fit in here? I'm really not sure. I don't know why their cards are so big. That doesn't fit in this. 
and then that one. Let's try in these ones. Okay. That looks alright. Okay. Ah, uh, great. So these, I, I, I threw away the plastic with the names of them. They're KMC sleeves, and I'm gonna try and find them because I bought them through Bayi, so I still have the history of all of my purchases, and I'll link them in the description. But they're pretty thick as well, like a bit like the Dragon Shield ones. They're very clear. And they're slightly bigger, so these cards fit perfectly in them. I think the Pentagon ones as well. And if you have as well the, you know, the all cards that you get, or well, that you get when you can go, when you could go to an SM concert. I think it was in Japan that they had that. For basically all the groups for like SM Town or uh, I think NCT had well I'm, I don't think I know NCT had them for their the origin tour as well there and these sleeves they fit these cards as well and they still fit in my pocket sleeves so that's really cool okay sometimes the thing is that the exact same size as the inside of the nine pocket sleeve like at, at this square so when i push the card too far up um it can stick out a little bit like not completely out but it really reaches the top of the sleeve so i try to remember and not put it all the way up and this one fit i'm not sure yet Oh, that's great. So way you need like four different kind of sleeves if you want to store all your photographs in sleeves. So I'm gonna go with the holo first. See, this one is very thick, so yeah, it's just about right. Then the transparent. And then the photo cards. Look. Oh wait, this album came out before Dumpty Dumpty. I'll switch things up later. I think I'm I'm gonna and I would like to collect the full group for idol as well. It's very low priority, but I will end up uh, separating all the albums and have one page per album, but yeah for now this will have to do. And then for the tickets so I put them in these, but they're the exact size. The, the width is exactly the same, so I'm not going to try and pull it out of the, the page because it was a struggle to get it in there. So yeah, maybe I'll try and find new sleeves for these, like new pages, because they're a bit too snug for my liking. In the meantime, this will have to do. Okay, I won't push it all the way down. Oops. So usually when I store cards and inclusions i put leader first and then in age order but yeah <laughs> magnet first this time because i'm not gonna try and damage anything in here oops you have to stay out of here okay so that was it for the girl group binder and moving on okay so this next one is gonna be quick uh, and for the next uh, three binders including this one i don't really have an order i tried to put groups in that i thought fit together but i don't collect yet any member 
uh, sometimes uh, if I find photo cards that I think are really really cute and are cheap enough, I will buy them. But they're not groups I full on collect. I just really like their music and try to get their albums when they come out. But yeah, that's about it. So these are the little cards that came with Oh Songu's debut album. They're very pretty. I really like the way this this like engraved face in it. They're so so pretty. And they should fit in six pocket pages. These pages I got a while ago, I think on Amazon. I can't really remember. It's been a good year I want to say. But it didn't arrive in the best shape, so I'm trying to find new ones because I'm starting to run out and they're really not the best one. I feel like dust really stick to it and I don't like it. And they were shipped to me, they came from a different country and they were shipped in just envelopes. So yeah, not, not the best idea. Some of them were really dented, so... They still have marks on them, but yeah. I'm gonna try and find a new place to get some because I like storing all, all all things from a group in the same binder and I can't do it right now because I don't have enough pages. So I still have inclusions running around like dead chilling in the box as well. Okay, so moving on to the next binder. We have Pentathonia here, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Alright. Here. Nope. Here. Um, so the cards fit in nine pocket pages. Um, and then I have the big sticker thing, um, I think, oops, it's not that big, so maybe it fits in there, so I don't have any two pocket pages left, so, yeah, he's gonna feel right here, facing the right album. And these are the same size as idol cards. At least two is consistent with one thing, right? So we have all these and I think I mixed them up. I don't really know how to do that because they have different bags, but then one is matte and the other is glossy. So I think I'm gonna clamp a version and then finish. Mm, so I'm gonna go. Why am I bothering that much for just putting cards in a binder? Let's just go with that. We're gonna do glossy first and then matte. And black version. I think the black version, the upside. And then we have the downside. Okay. That's gonna work. Ultimately, I would like to collect your one's card. But, yeah, again, not a priority. Oops. I just remember finding these two up here on Mercari at some point, so I just went with it. Oops, ah, there you go, and lastly, yeah, they're not in age order, I know I'm gonna really be thinking too much about that, 
it's okay ultimately i think if i do get a full your one set i'm gonna put him all together and then see with the rest how i arrange them but yeah for now this will be okay oops ah. okay. okay so moving on to this one i have three groups in this i think spectrum comes first I think this is my, like, this is gonna sound very stupid, but for my baby's binders, you know you have these groups where you just, oh, I want the best for you, you want the best for everyone, but they're the babies that you collect, that's this binder. So these are the cards from Spectrum's latest release, and for these groups I use the KMC mini hot clear, they come in 50 sleeves package, pa packets, packs, <laughs> they come in 50 uh, sleeves packs, These, that's the size, and they're a bit like the, they're a bit like the dragon shield, um, I, I'm not even sure you can tell the difference, honestly, it's just in my head, I know, so maybe... I think it's just the way they're made that's slightly different, but honestly, it's just these ones I buy through Bayi because it's a Japanese brand, so it's cheaper that way, but then it takes longer to get to me. Um, when the Dragon Shield ones, I can get in a shop in my city, so that's why I use them for basically my old groups. It just makes sense to me and price wise they're roughly the same i'd say because just the product itself the kfc ones are way cheaper um but then since they come from japan i have to pay a lot more for shipping when the dragon shield ones i can just usually get free shipping if i buy enough but <laughs> i always need more of these so yep that's the little film strip thingy and then this one I think I'm gonna need this should fit a full pocket page where am I gonna put you yeah they always stick out a bit I'll just put in there so that was their last album so I'm gonna have to try and find a way to arrange this better But yeah. <laughs> they're cute. So then we have one us. So for one us, these are all from Liz. I actually got their album through Make Star, and I got four copies. Yes. So these are the Make Star. Cause the the back is so beautiful, and yeah, they're super cute. Uh, I got the fourth one I got was Shion's, and I've been thinking for one as maybe I would like to not thoroughly collect, but at least for tr try and trade the ones I get in my albums. Uh, so I would like to get So, uh, Ido, Hwanung, and Connie's cards. So yeah, I'm gonna put up for trade my Xion's Mix Star for Connie's Mix Star. And then for photo cards, I got So and Connie. One red, one white. And all the other ones I got were either Raven or Xion's or duplicates of these. And same with these two. So yeah, I'm gonna put them up for trade on Instagram. So yeah, if you're interested, go check it out. And they'll be right there. These are so pretty. I need another page. I think I'm gonna put them all on another page by themselves. 
so for these I used the TMC ones as well. I'm super behind on Wonders Collection. Uh, I think I got my lift copies <laughs> when Devil came out, <laughs> so that says a lot about that. But yeah, their songs is just so so good. I don't think they have one bad song. So that is very enjoyable. Okay, so we have oopsie, the three next to our cards, and then I think I'm just gonna put them like that. And then for these two, I'm just gonna put them with the postcard from A Song Written So Easily. There we go. And then the last one I have in here is Davy's card. Uh, it's from the AB6 album. So I will put him with the AB6 cards. And I need to move these. And again, I use the Kinsey sleeves for these cards. There we go. Okay, and that's it for this binder. Binders I have um, are like top groups binders basically. In this one, I have three groups there's Scott Seven, Stray Kids, and MCMD. Um, and for Scott Seven, I've been starting to collect Jackson Scott, and at first, only these were prepared. And I caved like last week and prepared all JP pages as well. So it's not like a super high priority, but I will get to it eventually. Uh, first, I have MCND cards to store. So I have these two an ID card and a photo card. They're super cute. Just gonna put this one at the back. I don't know why I'm keeping this. I have no idea what to do with it now. I could use it as a bookmark, I guess. I have no idea where I put the string for this. Okay, so for these cards, I still use the dragon shield. Like for, for all my top groups, I use the dragon shield cards. So we have Wind's ID, there you go, oops, and Big's photo card, I'm gonna put him, oopsie, Nope. In between the two group cards. Yay. So, so cute. Yeah, so for MCND, I would like to eventually collect like full groups, full group, full sets. 
but we'll see how that goes. There's no rush again. Uh, so then I have so many God 7 cards to put away, to store away. I'm gonna start with the members I don't collect cards. So these are oops, Jesus cards. Yep. Okay. We have that many. Oh, I did not realize. So, oh no, I did not think this through. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to move everything. Mm, I'm just gonna get a new page. Okay, so I have these. This one needs to go there. Okay, finally understanding what I need to do to have things the way I want them to be. You're going in here. Okay. This, I don't want to move everything around, so I'll just move it to a whole different page. It just makes sense in my head. Okay. I guess I can call this a binder to a, a binder door as well. Okay. Actually, I don't know if I want to keep the unit cards with the rest of the cards. I really have no idea how I'm going to organize all this once I get a bit further in my collection, but I guess that's a future me thing to think about. Oops. Okay, and then we'll just move you all the way up. Oops, sorry, I'm completely out of frame. Bam, bam. This photo card set is so beautiful. All of them, all of them are so so pretty. Okay, and here we go. And then we have Last piece cards. That's so cute. Okay, 
so now I also have a few cards from the sixth fan meeting and I think it's the spinning spinning top tour so we're just gonna grab a couple of pages and sleeves these are all the six fan meeting cards oops yep so we have Jin Young Young Jin I have that one too wow so many Ben Ben <laughs> did not realize and Yu Young as well okay well cool I guess <laughs> Okay, so Jin Young. They have numbers on the back, so I think I'll just draw them. Like, I'll just follow the order they were given at first. Um, I mean, I kind of wanted to go with like era chronological order, I guess. But I'll see what I do. Maybe I'll do that for Jackson and JB, and I'll just let them chill. In order number. And lastly, you come. We have. 7, 21, 28, and 35. Oops. So we have that one first. Oh wow, I really can't see anything, can I? Yep. There we go. Okay, and I am done for these. We have, oh no, I forgot these. Okay, so we have the spinning top tour ones. And I'm gonna put like right under these. Genial. They were already in order because I keep putting, oops, I keep rearranging them. Young J. Oh, am I gonna be missing just one slot in this page for Ben Ben? For you, you're my finger, actually. 
Ingram's gonna be on his page on his own. Oh, come on. I hate when it does that. Okay. This. And then we have this Bam Bam selfie. And lastly, this Hugo's card on his own page. Wow. There we go. Oops. I'll get here because this video ended up being way too long, so I'll hopefully see you in the second half. And until then, take good care of yourself. Bye!